All right, welcome back. Thanks for joining. I am back with the Arcanine Break Evolution box. I was pretty excited when I heard this was coming out. Arcanine's a really cool Pokemon, in my opinion. So I definitely wanted to pick it up, and my Walmart had it right away, so that was awesome. Only 25 bucks, which I think is a really good price. You get five packs, and then the three breaks with the jumbo break. So I think that's I think that's pretty good. Pretty good deal. Alright, let's get everything out real quick. Um, oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay. Um I will show the jumbo first. So there is the Jumbo. It's actually the first Jumbo break I've ever gotten. I haven't bought any of the other break boxes, but that actually, that does look really nice. So that's cool. Oh, you know what? I'll just set this right there in the back. That'll look nice. Then we've got the other promos, which... Oh, okay, that's easy. So first up, we have the Crobat Break. Not too bad of an attack there. It's got a good amount of HP. My only thing, I'm pretty sure the only um, Crobat is from Furious Fist, which is not in standard, so that's a little bit of a bummer. Um, but I don't know, maybe they'll make a new one in Sun and Moon. I have no clue. Just kind of guess in there. That came out easily. So then next we have the Arcanine, which is obviously the main card of the box. Pretty good attack there, attached to basic energies, to a bench Pokemon, so that's cool. And I actually, I have a decent deck I use online with the new Arcanine, so that's what it would look like. You got the regular Arcanine. And then put the break over top of it. If nothing else, I'm going to try and use the break online just to give myself more HP. So you get 30 more HP, which is nice. So that looks cool. And then the third break is the Mandibuzz break, which looks nice. I do like breaks. I mean... A lot of times they're not necessarily the most competitive cards, but I think they look cool. I think it's a cool idea. This card really is pretty good. Does 20 damage to each of your opponent's Pokemon. Discard all Pokemon tool cards attached to each of your opponent's Pokemon. So that's pretty good. The only thing that stinks is it's kind of like a, a stage 2, so it'll take a little bit of time to get out. But it could, could be nice still. So I'm just going to put those all there in the back. And we have the five packs and the code card, which is for me. I'll give out some, at least one of the codes in the packs. So we've got Evolution, Steam Siege, Breakpoint, Evolutions, Fates Collide. We'll just go in that order, why not? So starting off with a Blastoise. I've kind of come, this, I don't know why this pack feels thick. I've come to the point where with these collection boxes, I, I'm only going to buy the collection boxes if I just really want it for the promos, because when you get one and you're mostly hoping to get good pulls, and then you don't, it's always like a really big letdown, so I'm just going to get the ones that have the promos that I like, then it's kind of a win no matter what. Ooh, nice, I need Charizard Spirit Links. Tangela, Machop, Weedle, Onyx, Staryu. Oh, nice. I think I have one of those, actually, but that's nice. And Eradicate. Okay. Steam Siege. So, yeah, if I get a good pull, I mean, you'd hope to get at least one shiny card out of five packs, but, I mean, if I get a good pull, it's just kind of a bonus to me. That's the way I'm looking at it, because... You get three breaks in the box, and I feel like it's a pretty good price anyways, so. 
Yeah, that's my rambling. All right, we've got a Nuzleaf, Armor Fossil, Shield on, Braviary, Litleo, Nidoran, Nosepass, Meowth, Hopip, Zwilus Reverse. Ooh, and a Talonflame. That's really good. And you know what? Oh, I'm going to run out of time. All right, I'm not going to move anything, but I have to delete video off of here. Okay, I'm back, and I have enough memory now. I forgot to delete stuff earlier. Okay, on to the Breakpoint Pack. Be nice to pull a Greninja Break or a... What is in this? A Ho-Oh EX? That'd be cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, get out of there. Okay, here we go. We have a Prugly Feyleaf. Oh, that is awesome. Max Elixir. I already do have four of them, but now I have five. That is awesome. Staryu, Esper, Pharaoh Seed, Electabuzz, Froki, a Shoulder Reverse. Oh, eh. <laughs> Not a very good EX, but it is an EX. I do already have it also, Embor. Kind of one of those really random EXs where you're not quite sure why they made it. But that is okay, it's a good pull. Alright, Evolutions. I'm wanting to try to go to some like actual tournaments. There's a place not too far from where I live that does um, some tournaments. It's like 10 bucks, so I don't know, it'd be fun to try and enter, see what I can do. Revive, Poliwhirl, Misty's Determination, Voltorb, Fire Energy, Vulpix, Tangela, Machop. Oh, nice! I already have that, actually, but a Machamp Rare Reverse, that's really good. <gasps> oh, I don't have that. Okay, that's that's really good. Wow. Well, I wasn't really expecting or hoping for much, but I've got really good pulls out of this box. Wow. That is awesome. I do not have that Mega Pidgeot. Wow. Okay. Last pack here. Fates Collide. What would I want out of this set? Uh, I don't really know. You know what? I said I was going to give away a code... Here, I'll give away that code. Evolutions. Alright. One, two, three. Last pack has a Shauna, Servine, Wormadom, Riolu, Gathita, Wismer, Mincino, Bolabi. Oh, a Lucario Rare Reverse. That's cool. And an Explode. Well, I got two rare reverses. I got a Talonflame, which is a good rare. And then I got an Embor EX, a Mega Pidgeot EX, and a Max Elixir. So I got a good, good mix of pretty decent cards. So yeah, thanks for watching.